Hi guys, I'm Serena Jane. Welcome to my global channel on YouTube. I'm here with Alvin Ailey for the World Dance on Stage performance. There are five choreographers from around the world that have come together to put what they're very well known for on the stage. So we have African dance, we have Middle Eastern dance, we have Brazilian dance, we have all kinds of dances, and of course, yours truly is bringing Indian dance to the stage as well. I'm super excited to show you guys, you know, what we all have created to put out Let's there. Let's go and check it out. Here with Samara, she's one of the choreographers for World Dance on Stage and she teaches Middle Eastern Dance. So tell us about Middle Eastern Dance. Well, Middle Eastern Dance has so many different uh, I, I cover so many different regions, due to the bond in North Africa. So a lot of times people think it's just belly dance. There's so many different kinds of folklore and different kinds of regions. So it's really an interesting, you know, dance form. I'm here with Maget, who teaches African dance here at Alvin Ailey. This guy is so well known. Every time I come into class, he's you know has live drums. Every time I walk in, it's always packed. Everyone's walking out going, wow, it was amazing. It makes me want to go and actually do his class. So maybe that, tell us about your piece. Where, what are you doing and where is it from and all of that good stuff. Uh, we're kind of doing our uh, dance from West Africa. So we're doing two pieces. Uh, the first piece is from Guinea. Guinea is in West Africa. And the second piece is from Mali, which is in West Africa. So we're doing two dances. One is called... Uh, John Dong, and the other one is called Son Sonny. So that's the two dance that we have doing. Guys, I'm here with Babaka. He represents Senegal. And so his piece is going to be really exciting because now we're really getting into the world. Tell us about your piece. Uh, my piece is called Sabar. It's from uh, Senegal, West Africa. It's called Sabar Dance, you know, and Sabar is a very excited dance, a lot of jumping. You know, it's, it's very excited. It's going to be good. I'm here with Kenya, who teaches Samba here at Alvin Ailey. And let me tell you, everybody knows who Kenya is. Probably around the world. She represents such amazing dance from Brazil and represents it to the T. So, Kenya, tell us about Samba. Tell us about your piece. Um, Samba is a dance that represents Brazil. When you talk about Brazil, we definitely like the last name is Samba. And Samba has uh, African influence, dance, African dance influence, indigenous and Portuguese. And my piece represents Samba from Rio, what is the big carnival time that we do a big parade every year with big costumes and big feathers and outfits and shiny. Okay, so now can anyone do Samba? Anyone can do Samba, you just have to be open for the spirit, for the Brazilian spirit. So amazing! And to see you all, like I talk to people in the elevators, and just seeing the confidence and the, the people walking around and saying like, yes, I'm dancing, I'm performing, oh my gosh, I swear, I feel like a goofball. I'm crying, it's so beautiful. It's so, I think this is Alvin Ailey and what yeah. Ailey was. Miss Alabanger to me has been an amazing experience from the get go. I so I was intrigued by it and absolutely scared to death when I saw the choreography, but I knew it was just something that I had to try. It's been such a good experience for me. I've learned so much about myself and so many other people and what I'm really capable of and what I can give back. It's a wonderful form of dance, creative expression, and just a whole lot. I first started taking Masala Brangra at my gym, with, and from since then I fell in love with it. And I've been going faithfully every Saturday, sometimes on Monday night. It's a challenge for me because I'm at the same time I'm learning the moves and I I have to say uh, let me just say this I had no coordination before I took Masala Brangra and taking Masala Brangra I have developed tremendous amount of coordination I started taking Masala Brangra about two years ago 
um, I had lost a whole bunch of weight and my Weight Watchers leader said, well, the only way that you're going to keep it off is if you stay active. So I just walked into the salad bar one day. I just picked it off of the class list. And I fell in love with it. Banya has been so inspirational and has balanced my life and kept me also mentally sane. So it's been wonderful. I love dancing. I'm from Punjab in India. I love Bhangra. I've never performed before and this has been such an exciting and amazing experience. Hey guys, it's Tamina Jade for the Global Channel. I certainly hope you enjoyed Whale Dance on stage here at the Alvin Ailey. We're part of the extension program. Let's go.